Thanks, Allie. Well, there's a new exhibit, and it's taken over the Niagara, or Buffalo Niagara Visitor Center, and it's celebrating America's pastime with Buffalo's favorite team. Their history spans more than 100 years, and during that time, the Buffalo Bisons have gone through many changes, from uniforms to where they played ball. The team has played a defining role in Buffalo's character, and now anyone who pays a visit to the Buffalo Niagara Visitor Center Gallery can see it up close. This is an exhibit of uh, history of Buffalo Bisons baseball, dating back to 1877, um, right through the, what I call the golden age of Buffalo. Uh, in baseball 1987 when War Memorial Stadium closed. And if anyone is qualified to talk about the golden age of Bison baseball, it's John Boutte. In fact, a lot of the memorabilia comes from him directly. Personally, myself, I've always been a collector uh, since I was a little kid. My father used to take us to War Memorial Stadium to see the Bills or the War Memorial Auditorium to see the Sabres and the Braves. And I was always the, the little kid running around the, the odd or the rock pile picking up ticket stubs, programs, anything that I could save. And by the looks of what's on display, John did a good job of keeping all the stuff. Perhaps one of the more impressive parts of the exhibit are some of the photographs. Color photography in the, in the 1950s was in its infancy. Not a lot of color photographs were taken by fans. And uh, we were lucky to uh, uh, accumulate some uh, color photographs of Offerman Stadium. And John says it's these pieces that really help tell the story of the Bisons. And for Peter Burakowski, the man in charge at the Visitor Center, it was quite a task laying it all out for us to see. Having a Bison exhibit is unique for us uh, because most often we have photography of architecture or people and places around Western New York. And this is a nice change of pace for us to have a, a focus on um, Buffalo's proud baseball history. And I think people are really connecting with it too. You know, as you look around the room and you see everything from posters to pennants to, uh, to baseball gloves and uniforms, it's something that people really connect to. Yeah, really.